Hey guys, what is up? This is the Shadowed Ones, and today it's a tutorial and showing you off this mod pack on Hexit.Minecraft. Well, basically, this is how it's going to go. You see this here? That's Gary's mod, so you're not allowed to touch it. Well, basically, we're going to go on Safari. This is how you download uh, a text pack on Minecraft or anything like that. And all you have to go to is um, uh, Minecraft Hexit. You know, uh, just Hexit text packs, like right there. Boom. And uh, basically, yeah, this is the pack I got. Cause it's the only pack on Hexit at the moment on the website from PlanetMinecraft.com. I should totally suggest it. And you get this website up there. Like that. This is how you do it on the Mac. I don't know how you do it on the PC. I'd search that up. This is how you do it the correct way. So the more views it gets, the higher it could go. And people are going to look at the correct way of doing this. So basically, you got the red spec. And it's the um, Exit Edition. You know, you got that. You got that. You got it like that. And then look, boom. Go with that, which looks awesome. Uh, so I've already got it downloaded right here. But basically, you gotta click download, it sends you to another tab. Uh, you gotta wait for it to load. And then look straight away, it puts you into your download. Don't know why it sent two files there. Fuck you. Uh, oh wait, it does send two files for your information, so I'll just say get this and this and basically just just, just like you know stop one of them. Don't do why I don't stop both of them. Basically, just like click on it. Uh, shit, I got to download it again. <laughs> well. Not zip, opened, yep, there you go. Boom. Cancel. I fucked this up already. Show in Finder. You gotta show this in Finder, and there you go, it's right there. But basically, you get this and you put it on your desktop. And you do that. And that's that, it's on your desktop now. What you gotta do is you gotta open it up. And then all of this, what you gotta do is you wanna highlight the whole thing, the whole box. Then go to that, and it says you know burn or compress 22 items or compress whatever items it there is in it. You'll probably get 22 if you download the same pack. Compress, and as you see there, it's copying all together. And as you see right here, a new file has been made. Now what you gotta do is put that to your desktop, and now when you do that you can go off this and put that in your trash can yay we've done it that's not the end though you yet have to put it in your library so you have to do that if you go to library uh, you want to go to library and you want to find he uh, the hexit file if you can't find it in your library what you gotta do is go to that and you click on this, you get this up. I don't know why that's my account name, don't ask. Um and then you can double click the options and then you get this. What you want to do is click open. And there you go. Alright, now you've got two up. Now you do that. Right. Get out of that. Put that down there, and then basically you open up this, and as you may see right here, I've put it in there. But let's put that in there, and put this one in there. Real oh, cancel. Uh, let's just name it Reds again, and then go back and go to texture packs. 
Now, as you may see here, it's a copy file. This hasn't been copied. What you gotta do is you gotta move that to trash. Because I didn't do I didn't copy it. You gotta go back to this one. Go on this. Duplicate. Excuse me, file. Put that on your desktop. Go back. Go to text packs. Put that in there. And then you got all of them in there. Now uh you go to Java. Well whatever it, whatever you call it. Technic thing, whatever. Technic mod pack hexit. This is the hexit mod pack. You you know, do that. And then you open up hexit. And if you're on Mac, Hexit does do a little glitch on it where it puts it upside down. Don't worry, just click Controls or Command F11, uh, and it should put you straight on to full screen without it being not upside down and all that. Now we're just waiting for it to load up. Don't know why it's taking this long. I'm going to do be right back because it's going to take this long. As you may see here, it is upside down. Yes, we know that. You just have to click on it. Control F11 straight away puts you onto the game with it uh, upside up. <laughs> yeah, I think that counts. And straight away into texture packs, you can do that. I'm gonna carry on. With the normal texture pack, uh, created this one a couple of minutes ago. Okay. And then I'm just going to show you the difference between this mod and the mod, uh, and look, this uh, texture pack and the um, normal texture pack. We, I don't even think we have a door in my house. As you may know, I've done this world off creative. And there you go. This is the normal texture pack. Just gonna get rid of that. And yeah, just gonna go into my house. Blue lighting, my books, my shelves of all my weapons. Okay. Right, the spider and a transporter. We're gonna go through that near the end of the um near the end of the video. Uh, so now we go to escape and we go to options and then we go to texture packs and red's copy is the one. Now, if you don't have them in both texture packs, then it will corrupt your data on Minecraft, so I'll put them in both texture pack folders, even the copy one. And there you go, already changed. And look, this is how nice it looks. I love this texture pack. Oh man, I got a bit of a lag spike there. But this texture pack looks so nice, makes it... Take puts that more or less realism in there, and uh, we'll just make it a bit like to dusk or something. Right now, nah, let's play it to midnight for a sec. Probably gonna get yeah. Look, you see how nice it looks. Uh, say it's a new and yeah, that's basically it. I'm just gonna take one of my swords out just in case I need to fight fight anything. Um, I'm probably gonna use this one since it looks awesome. All right, we go. I say I take one of my swords out, and yeah, again, I fucking take the whole book case okay, so out. We go in here, and it teleports us. But don't even know where we're going. Ah, <sighs> I wonder how they end up in this. And then you spawn and uh, 
Alright, so that's the door. Alright, I'm just gonna get some potions. Uh, night vision. Okay, where am I? Looks like I'm in the nether. It's definitely not cool. Take me in the nether. Yeah, it looks like I'm in the nether. Right, let's go back. Why oh, is there a chest in it? Oh, Rift Signature! First click stores location, second stick creates two rifts that link to the first location to the second location. Fabric of reality, wow! Never had this before, but I'm gonna try it. I, don't I, I really don't wanna. Who are you FaceTiming? Who are you FaceTiming? Alright, well anyway. And just, yeah, pretty much. That's, that's all that does. And yeah, I'm trying to get back home now. Do my best to get home. And I get back home, it looks like. Get my home? Yay, I'm home. Spider, fuck you! And I'm home. Yay. Anyway guys, that's how you download a texture pack and how good it looks. It looks very good. Um, anyway guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon.